I gave in. Which I probably shouldn't have done. But like, Instagram has been bombarding me with ads for this company for months and months and months. That at some point you just break and you fall in their trap and you spend... Hundreds of euros on their websites. My god. We are all aware of the horrible thing that is Instagram, Instagram advertisement. advertisement. Oh my god, some companies have the most insane advertisement budget. And one of those companies is Emil. So yeah, I fell for a trap and I bought a lot of clothing from them. Which I'm going to try on today for the first time so we can see if it's worth the money <laughs> because it looks good on the website it looks very nice but i've got a feeling that those are not the actual products but yeah let me just try it on and then see what it's gonna look like you know mm -hmm. by the way before i put the clothing on i just want to say that like the whole ordering and shipping stuff was kind of weird because i never got a like shipping confirmation i never got a tracking code and i did receive my package like a week after i ordered it which was pretty fast but like so many items are missing and i cannot find any information about those items at all i didn't get any emails i didn't get any texts nothing i emailed them asking them where the rest of my order is and i still haven't gotten a reply yet so <laughs> That's a great start! I bought everything in like specific outfits, but since half of my order is missing, I'm not sure if I can make the outfits that I had planned. But yeah, we'll just see, okay? So yeah, first fit. Why do I keep doing this? It's like a new thing. I'm like, fuck yeah, boy! Anyways, first fit mm, is this. These are just some black pants with a belt. Love it. It's giving a lot of like zeros vibes, which I love. And then supposedly I have a matching top with that. But let's see if I actually got it or not. Cause you never know. I got it. Yes. How does this work? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's just like a black top with like a belt in the front. I think it's cute. Oh my god, why did that just make me dizzy? There was one spin. <laughs> Anyways, first outfit. I like the overall vibe of this outfit. You know, I love what it's giving. However, there's like things wrong with every item. I mean, overall the pants, I like them. They're very comfortable. They're the right size. Um, I kind of wish that like the belt holes <laughs> were like going all the way around the pants. I think that would have been way better. But the weird thing is that it doesn't have a button. I can show you. Like there's supposed to be something here. So you can <laughs> do this, you know? I think I'm gonna give them three Pablos, which is pretty okay. The fabric is very cheap though. The top, however, oh my god, it has so much potential, but like, it's just a weird top. First of all, I mean, it's longer than I wanted it to be, but like the sizing of this, I don't know. It's like, this top is very weird. Like the straps in the back are cutting in my neck. So I don't think that I can wear this for longer than an hour, but like the, this is just too small. Okay, this is just, I don't know. It feels weird. I don't know, I'm gonna give this top two out of five Pablos. It had a lot of potential, but it just didn't work. Sad, sad. Pants. Oh, they look big. What size is this? My God. Size S. Oh wait, I think these are low waisted. Yeah. Okay, so these are some cargo pants. I'm gonna insert the picture here, but I'm pretty sure they, they are not the same color as the picture because I can't imagine getting this color. <laughs> Wait, what is this? <laughs> oh yeah, these are some sleeves. Oh my god, this is so complicated. And this cute top. 
I think it's gonna be a nice combo. So let's put that on. Hey, outfit number two. I got this top in a size M and normally I am a S. And I kind of regret that now because even though like this top is like sitting great, perfect, nothing wrong with it. Like the sleeves are a little bit too big and they keep like falling down like this, which is very annoying. Um, these pants, I hate them. Oh my God. I already like thought I was gonna hate them when I took them out of the packaging, but it's just, it's definitely not what I envisioned. Because like this is the picture and these are the pants. Oh my God. It has fake pockets. No way. Does it have pockets in the back? Ah, fake. Why do they keep making fake pockets? Why do they think that we don't carry anything? Mm. No, this is said, I do not like this one. I like the top, but only this top. But if this would have fit, I would have given it a four. These pants, unfortunately, I'm gonna give them a one. And if I wanna like change that outfit up a little bit, I can also wear <laughs> these sleeves. I mean, these are very cute. I love it when the stuff is like knitted, you know? Looks nice. And then I also got a very nice accessory with it. <laughs> and that is... <sighs> yeah, boy! Okay, 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 okay. I actually really love this top. Oh my God, I think it's so cute. Look at it. It has absolutely no functionality whatsoever, except for the fact that it looks cute, which is very important indeed. The cap, not really sure what I think about it yet. Kind of has to grow on me a little bit, I think. I mean, I guess it could work. I'm not really used to seeing myself <laughs> with a cap on. This is gonna give a 5 out of 5. Pablitos, the cap. I mean, it's a great cap. Don't have anything bad to say about it. So I guess I'm gonna give this 5 out of 5 fabulous too. Yeah, yeah. Should I wear it backwards? Oh my god, do I look cool right now? Shit, so cool. Mm, and I beat someone up. Yeah. Urgh. Ever since I saw this picture of Bella Hadid, I'm honestly obsessed with like the parachute skirt. Um, I also know that it's very trendy right now, which honestly, I think it's all just because of that one picture. <laughs> Cause she makes it look so good. So obviously I had to get myself some parachute skirt too. Oh my god, it looks, it looks so thin. I can literally see the lights, like, shine through it. Oh my god, this is so thin. That's not, that's not the nice quality. No, 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 no. And then for on top of that, I got a very, a very crazy shirt. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Um, yeah, what do I have to say about this outfit? I think it's actually like pretty nice, but it has like the same problem as the first outfit where like overall, if you just look at it, you will think like, okay, it's fine. But then if you look at the details, it's just some things, you know, that you will kind of like want to change a little bit, you know? For example, this skirt, I mean the color, perfect, muy bien, amazing. Linda. <laughs> Linda, yeah. But like the fabric is just so freaking thin, which I guess would be fine if you live in like a warmer climate. I mean, global warming did make our country a lot warmer than it used to be. So I guess maybe in a few years it can actually like fit the, our climate. But for now, it's a little bit too cold. But then uh, also, this 
zipper area it just sticks out like it doesn't really want to lay flat which is something that annoys the shit out of me and again fake pockets oh my god look at the size of them like this whole thing this is all fake this is all make-believe why would you do that um but i like the vibe of the skirt though like this is cute little balloon at the top I think like overall I like it, but the fabric is like... <sighs> it feels nice to the skin, like it feels very soft, but I think I'm gonna sweat like crazy in this fabric. Because I am a sweat monster and polyester items are probably not like the best choice for me. So I feel like this is gonna look cute, but I'm gonna smell terrible. <laughs> I'm gonna give the skirt, I think, 2 out of 5 Pablos. And this top, I'm gonna give it 3 out of 5 Pablos. So yeah, since I didn't get half of my order sent to me, <laughs> I only got two items left now. The first one is a white top, which I'm literally wearing a white top right now. But this one has crosses on it, okay? So it's different. <laughs> and another shirt with holes in it <laughs> oh my god i love shirts with holes <laughs> sounds so weird <laughs> um if i take my hands away this video will get demonetized so <laughs> i won't be doing that oh my god maybe i can put like my hair in front of it wait yeah okay so this top, even though it's very cute, even though I like how it looks, it's just very see-through. Like very, very, very see-through. Like you can definitely see the color of your nipples see-through. This is not gonna work. I'm sorry. I'm gonna give this one out of five Pablos. I should have probably gotten like one, two, maybe three sizes smaller. <laughs> Because even though I'm a big fan of oversized stuff, this is, I mean, a little bit too oversized, maybe? It's a little big. <laughs> not gonna lie. It's a very big. But that's not gonna stop me from wearing it because I actually really like this one. It's definitely not a sweater made for winter times because I am inside now and I am still cold. So, yeah. But overall, it looks cute. It looks cute and I like it. I like it. I like it. <laughs> I like it. So yeah, I'm gonna give this one five out of five. Five out of five. Okay, everybody, this was my try on haul of the company that keeps stalking me on Instagram. <laughs> By the way, I am still getting a shit ton of advertisements from them. <laughs> like, spending. 350 euros didn't stop them from bombarding me. And the funny thing right now is that they literally advertise the stuff that I bought. Wait, this is kind of weird, right? Uh, I was like, wait, there's a hole in this cap, but it's like, that's for your ponytail, right? It's still very weird. Don't you normally do your ponytail like in here? Why would they make a separate hole? Why would they make like a glory hole for your ponytail? It's kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie. This one is gonna... It's gonna lose a Pablo for that. Four Pablos for this one. <laughs> Anyways, overall, my thoughts about everything that I got is... Do not buy from this website. I wouldn't recommend it. I mean, the items that I got were all pretty bad quality. Yeah, they are cheap, but they're not even that cheap. To be honest, like, I mean, a Bershka or a Pull&Bear or an H&M, I feel like those have like lower prices than this website and their quality is definitely better. <laughs> and also, you may not get the things that you ordered, <laughs> which happened to me. They did send me an email, by the way, like literally five minutes ago, and apparently the items were out of stock. So that's why they didn't send them to me but they never notified me of that. And they also never refunded me for the items that I didn't receive. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get my money back, 
but they wanted me to pick out some new items instead of refunding me so let's see how that goes <laughs> okay thank you for watching and i'll see you in my next video kiss kiss bye bye ciao ciao kiss kiss bye bye ciao ciao